thank you for everyone running the London Marathon for Children with Cancer UK. Here we are at the 2019 Virgin Money London Marathon. And at Children with Cancer UK, we have over 1,200 runners running for the same cause, which is helping more children ring the end of treatment bell. The support of the team's been fantastic. Been a lifelong dream, never run it before. I absolutely loved it. Yeah, such a great atmosphere. Yeah. It's really, yeah, really amazing. Yeah, honestly exhausted, but, but proud I managed to do it. Yeah. Well, and believe in the crowd, yeah. make the most of the crowd. Uh, all the motions, really. The crowd was just taking up, but they, they carry you all the way through, you know. I'm so happy that I was able to earn this. A flower girl at my wedding, um, when she was seven, got kidney cancer and uh, she suffered for 14 months with chemotherapy and manual therapy um, before she beat the disease. Um, she's now 12 and she's a success story and she inspires me so much. I just want more children to be success stories like Fire. One of our friends' daughters got leukaemia, so we ran together for her. Yeah, we raised, I think, together with all the team, over £40,000 for our charity. When I was seven, I had leukaemia, so it's obviously quite a big reason to run for the charity. I mean, it's been a big journey. Like, a year ago, I could barely run 30 seconds down the road, so it's taken a lot, but if you can beat cancer, you can, this is easy. We got the beads. <laughs> um, and so what happens with the beads is children with cancer, they get beads every time they go through a new round of chemotherapy, a new treatment, a new hospital. We got given a bead for ourselves and a bead for the child. We run around with it and we send them back to the children and they get the bead that's been around the London Marathon, which is amazing. That's something that wasn't happening when I was ill, so it's quite a, big, it's quite a nice thing to have. I have got your bead. I took it with me on the 26.2 miles, 0.2 is important. Yeah, yeah, and now you can have it back. Wow, thanks. It's a charity that's worthwhile. Yeah. Amy, Amy had cancer when she was when she was younger. She had leukemia. But yeah, so everyone had still a bit and them. No, it was very no. emotional. <laughs> um, my friend ran last year. Her boy died of cancer six years ago. I promised I'd run it this year, so I did. A child shouldn't have to go through cancer. But it seems like we're making headway with it as the charity. I feel tired, but it's nothing compared to what the children who are diagnosed with cancer go through. It's a pain in February when it's absolutely freezing, it's pouring down the rain, you're thinking, why am I doing this? But when you come today, you look back thinking, that's why I've done it. Do it. Just do it. Come and do Don't it. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Just do it. If you're going to do it, pick something that's really worthwhile. Do it. Do it. <laughs> and I think even if you're even if you're crawling around, you're walking around, the atmosphere is incredible. Like it's, I would put it over there as one of the best days of my life so far. So if you're watching this and you're thinking, hey, I could run a marathon, I'd like one of those really heavy medals, <laughs> then I would absolutely encourage you to do it because there are two really important factors I think to this. Number one, you will help extraordinarily people like Sam, who frankly is an absolute legend. And number two, it's in itself a genuinely rewarding experience. It's nice to run a marathon. Yeah, and you get a free apple at the end, they give you two in a bag. Do it. <laughs>